gave me a call and said, what do you think about Sugar Ray and Johnny Burgeon for New Year's Eve? And I was like, cool, what do you think? And he goes, I did it. So it was already set up and we're gonna do it. We just wanna thank everybody who's helping us out to make this happen, including all of you for buying up the tickets. Put your hands together for the guy with the vision, Paul Ben. Alright, alright, welcome and happy New Year's Eve 2019. We're going into New Year's Eve 2020. I'd like to thank everybody for coming. Like Harold said, I do too. Kind of out of my frustration for not finding something to do last New Year's Eve. And I said, I'm going to put my money where my mouth is and I'm going to do something. And I did it. So. Yes, indeed. Uh, I'd like to thank everybody for coming. We've got, uh, I'd like to thank uh, Flo Hoxie for everything. And Harold Tremblay, Jeff, Jeff Ray doing the sound tonight. Gene for doing that. We got some appetizers back there, little treats for doing that back there for us. And everybody else that had name that was a big part of this. So I want to thank everybody, all the workers. I've got three of my favorite artists up here tonight. We've got Johnny Bergen, the great Mitch Cashmar, and the one and only Sugar Ray Norcia. So. It's going to be a great evening. We got a big dance floor here, everybody. Save your tickets. We're going to do a champagne toast at midnight. We got a champagne cocktail. If you want coffee or soft drink at that time, you're more than welcome. Sugar Ray's going to sing "Auld Lang Syne," so it's uh, it's probably like you never heard it before. Mitch is going to play harp on it, so it's going to be a night to remember. How about a big hand, everybody? The rockin' Johnny Bergen. How's everybody feeling? Are you ready for some blues? Yeah. 